I just wanted to say thank you guys all so much for creating Lovely. this beautiful community. Um, that's something that I don't think everyone has, and it's a really powerful thing. Thank and uh, thanks for all the poets who shared too. Yeah. <laughs> this poem is called Heavy Inheritance. Little flint rocks came together in my mother's womb and sparked my existence. While I swirled in the cosmos of my mother's body, it was deemed I would be female. Blessed ribbons of eggs were bestowed in my tiny body, and for a time, my, body, my mother carried me and my daughter, just a cell in my unborn body. I was stitched together by the memories of my ancestors, slaves screaming tears of aching anguish, English children splashing in muddy puddles, African dancers rejoicing in the rain. Spanish women who knew the dances of their mothers. Indian braves with troubled hearts. I was given heavy blessings of addiction, turmoil, joy, prayer, peace, and terror. Sometimes I feel alone as though there is no mirror which will reveal my reflection. There is no breeze that can touch me and no star who can see me. I break and crumble under the weight of identity and loneliness, oneness and the responsibility I wear like a thorned crown that is breaking my neck. My therapist asks, what are you so afraid of? I'm afraid that everyone will see me for who I am. I am no feared queen of old. I am no mother hen. I am no matriarch who gracefully wears wisdom like a cloak. I am no naked rebel with flowers in her hair. I am just sad. But as I lay buried under the dirt, sprouts emerge from my lifeless body. As I lay drowned at the bottom of the ocean, my body becomes coral. As my daughter looks me in the eye and needs me, my heart glows and pumps. I shake out all the silk in my hair and grow a mane. I raise my hackles and show my teeth. I dare the lightning to strike me. I feel the elder mother's spirit and she tells me, I am the lotus. I am honeybee. I am the color of the sky after the sun sets and before the night rises. I am rolling, cleansing ocean. I am soft. I am terrible. I am Mother Teresa. I am Hitler. I am but an ember derived from the fabric of existence. I am a skin casing over a tiny universe. I am but a spark derived from the fabric of existence, as are you. I am you. As you are me, and isn't that both comforting and terrifying to be both so tiny and so massively huge? <laughs>